This is Matt and Jenny Barker. This week, Matt accidentally left their black adopted daughter, Katera Barker, in a car all day where she later died because of the heat. Neither of the adopted parents are being charged. According to Metro Police, the father, Matt Barker, unintentionally left his one-year-old daughter in the car seat. DCS determined that Barker did not stop at the child's daycare Wednesday morning. He or his wife, Jeannie Barker, would typically take Katera and her five-year-old sister to a daycare facility on Chapel Avenue. From there, the five-year-old would take a shuttle to her elementary school. No charges expected for Nashville dad who left baby in hot vehicle, CBS News reports. The Department of Children's Services has opened an investigation into a family that lost a child after she was left in a hot truck all day. Her birth mother, who was not publicly identified by News Channel 5, told the station that she learned about the toddler's death Wednesday night when the adoption agency informed her that there had been a terrible accident. She said she was devastated by the news and she wants to know what exactly happened. Police say the father flew home that Wednesday night and they have been cooperating. You don't have to be a history buff like me to know that the American justice system has and will always be flawed. And when I say flawed, I do mean in many ways the issues are multifaceted. But particularly to people of color, the American justice system has been a part of our oppressor and it continues to be till today and it is certainly disproportioned in favor to the colonists that started the justice system, which we know was the Europeans when they won the Revolutionary War against the King of England. So now in 2018, when typically we see couples being charged criminally for neglect and manslaughter for leaving their children in hot cars, we see it all the time. What is any different about this adopted white family? My heart is truly broken the most for the biological mother who put her daughter up for adoption, no doubt thinking she was giving her a better life, a better chance at life. But obviously she didn't mean as much to her adopted parents as she meant to her biological mother. And it's her who my prayers are with. Baby girl, you were no Barker at all. If you had been, he wouldn't have left you in the back seat. His oldest daughter, the five-year-old, she was dropped off successfully at elementary school. It was you that was forgotten. So for that, baby girl, I think you should just be called Katera. So YouTube Streets Neighborhood, I challenge you, help get this little girl's story out. Help get her justice. That's my little girl you hear in the background. I'm a mother. I would never, ever forget my child in a car. And if my husband is responsible for taking my children to school or daycare, I call and confirm with him that everything went okay that morning. I'm on it. That's what moms do. Help get this little girl justice, YouTube streets. Jetta Liar, whoever, Freedom Fries, who, whoever. Get this little girl's story out. Get her some justice.